Good morning everybody from Bali. This is our first morning, our first full day here in Ubud city. Yeah, last night we came over from Changgu and we just did a yoga class and dinner and we're gonna spend the day exploring the city. Let's do that. Walking along this path, it's just not too far off of the main road. It's about a 15 minute walk and it's pretty cool. It feels like jungle feel and there's a proper sidewalk, which is really nice. So you can just walk if you want. It's a walk, it's a walkable area, which I like a little better than the Changu area that we were staying in last time. It looks like we're in a jungle. Do you feel like we're in a jungle? Not yet, but it starts. It starts, it begins. Got some nice chompers. <sighs> it's pretty humid in here, but it's nice because this area is paved, even though you're like right beside this jungle, and I'm able to walk around in my sandals and it's fine, but there are people running and everything. It's a nice little path so far, I like it. I walk a lonely road, the only one that I have ever known. So I feel like when I see him walking along this path, Mm -hmm. I was just singing to you. I was serenading you. So this looks super epic, but for some reason, that reminds me of a Walking Dead house. It's been abandoned. I don't know why, maybe it's because we've been watching The Walking Dead lately, but there's a walker. <sighs> no lie, this is pretty beautiful. Look at that, how cool is that? This is a nice walk even though I'm like sweating, not because of how difficult it is, mainly because of the humidity. It's like a sauna. We're just walking along this path and it's really nice. Look at how gorgeous the scenery is. Oh, this doesn't really feel real. It's really pretty. It, they kind of look like paintings, like these palm trees, they look so unreal. And they're just blowing in the wind. Oh, it's gorgeous. Phil's leaving me to do the time lapses on the GoPro. I can't keep up. There's a Phil! I found him! So what I really like about this walk here, the Ridge Walk, is uh, it's a very nice change. Yeah. And it doesn't feel like you're one step away from death all the time because yeah. there is no traffic here. Yeah. It's just like walking. There's an occasional scooter or car. It's, it's nice and peaceful. There. I really like it. Yeah. Changu is not very walkable. In Ubud it's way more walkable, but still it's super heavy traffic and that's a little bit annoying. The point is uh, you can walk relaxed. Yeah. You can you're relax. Not... You don't have to think about do I step into traffic? Is there a scooter behind me coming, hitting me almost? And this is a very nice change. Uh, looks cool. You're in between rice fields, there's this canyon with a river on the bottom and it's super green. This is really pretty. And right wow. now it just opened up in the background and these huge uh, mountains in the background That's appear. Really pretty. Oh, I love palm trees and mountains together. I don't know why, that combination I really like. Take a little breaker doodle, got a coconut and a coke. Do your feet hurt yet? No, it's fine. It's not that it's not that long of a hike, but it's very nice, it's calming and uh, it's also not that sunny today. Yeah. It's humid but it's gloomy, so mm. it's fine. There's a nice breeze. We did yoga yesterday and I'm feeling a little sore on my legs. Do you feel sore? No. We just stretched, there was no <laughs> muscle involved. There was muscle. Well stretched. Maybe you weren't doing it right. Yeah, I definitely <laughs> was not doing it right. <laughs> wind's gonna blow him on my face. That's probably the size of my face. By the time those legs spread out, 
Oh my god. That's crazy. So whenever I watch a new series or I watch anything, I really get into it. And I think in my everyday life, what, like how I would react if that were to be a reality. So we just got really scared from that spider that was there, but then I thought of Walking Dead and I was like, would I be able to handle zombies? Like, what do you think you would do? Would you hide somewhere? Would you actually kill them? Would you just freeze? I think it's very easy to, especially for guys, it's very easy to be like, yeah, I would totally be like calculated killer i would survive they yeah. make stupid mistakes but i think if a situation like that would happen you you don't know what kind of person you would be what kind of character you are you have no idea yeah like you said i like to think i would like i would survive i would be brave enough but then i just see my reaction on some of these like bugs and i'm like no i might freeze <laughs> up and just die i would be eaten <laughs> yeah you got into walking that a oh. lot deep I'm getting into it we're, we're like, only on season two we just finished season two and it's been like uh, i don't know four or five days maybe it's so addicting we, like we watch a lot I just watch a few before bed and then i'm just like good cat stop <laughs> i just love series it's so much it's series uh it's awesome because you can always continue it's like a very long awesome movie you can just yeah, continue there's so many good series out after there. a movie i get sad it's done yeah it's over it's not zombies are my thing now they are I would outrun them and I would have my machete and then I would be the girl with the two on the back. She just appeared. Okay, so we just made it out of the ridge walk. Um, it starts right there where this, this bridge is. Yeah. You can and spend a long time there or you could I mean you could just like fly through it but we decided to take our time there. Yeah there are a lot of good nice. picture spots and a lot of people just stop to take pictures there. Yeah. And, and a lot of good coconuts. Yeah. You can park your scooter right here if you have one. According to my fitness tracker, it was about six kilometers. So oh. three each way. But I think it's really up to you at what point you want to turn around. Yeah. Um, it's just two until the little restaurants and everything and you can go a little further yeah. but civilization starts again and it's not as nice anymore yeah and then you just walk up this street and main street is right here it starts right there it's very nice super relaxing so much calmer than this area it's great okay so we made it back to the city center somebody is very I'm tired so tired uh, we have a rooster that doesn't know what kind of morning it is who just goes ah. Well, it gets bright before six, and so yeah. he uh, does his thing very early. Yeah. Yeah. We just had a little snack. Uh, we're gonna take a little break. We might head out again to check the palace or something. We might not. All right. So it's pretty rainy right now. It's uh, started storming a little earlier, and this is the setup. It's no table here. No table. Phil's gonna edit, but. The best part is, look at this. Oh, he has a v-neck. It was so cloudy today. It was gloomy and uh, the sun came out for, it felt like a minute and I was so sunburned, dude. I mean, Bali is slightly in the southern hemisphere and it's summer here, so it's right on the actual equator right now. It's so much stronger, dude. I'm sure. He's got a nice red v-neck going on. Yeah. Anyways, since it's raining, we're probably not going to be doing much else video-wise today. We're going to do work on our computer a little bit and uh, watch Walking Dead because I'm really excited to see what happens Season next. Season 3. Season 3. I'm so pumped. Anyways, if you like this video, give this video a big thumbs up. Check out some of our other videos and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And we're going to see you from Ubud. Yes. Thanks for watching. Bye.